Doctor Doom's suit is finally finished and we can finally harness the power of Pandora's box. A secret island will appear in game. It will spawn into games randomly and has a 5% chance of spawning in. Once there, claim the cauldron, take the power of Doctor Doom. <laughs> and it seems pretty broken. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, you're the kicking effect! Oh my god, there's no way. Oh my god, it recharges that quick as well. Oh, this is OP. If we take a look at the bonus rewards, Doom, we have a loading screen, a cape, weapon wraps, a shield, a fist from Doom as well. Dr. Doom himself. People have a problem with collab bonus rewards, but if they're like this, I don't mind them. Some Lego stuff as well, and some upgrade styles for the other things we just talked about, and a very interesting emote that could hint towards Dr. Doom destroying the Chapter 5 map. There seems to be locations on this map as well because I haven't got it in game. It'd be interesting to see where these are. By in game, I mean I can't see the bird's eye view of this emote. And this is what Doom's been working towards. Pandora's Armor Doom. Doom above all, which is of course shown when his island spawns in. He is watching us all. We also now have super styles in game. The Arcane Burn, the Cold Sorcery, and of course, Doom's Forge War. These are some top super styles. But this week, we have some very interesting information regarding what's coming up for this season's storyline, which involves Hope, Doom, John Jones, and Shuri. And Shuri's invention could accidentally lead us to the Chapter 2 island. This is my theory anyway. Okay, our friend is just finishing up a supply run, but I've patched them in. Run us through the plan? Shuri thinks she can reverse the energetic flow of the Rift Beacons with Rift Recalibrators. That would give us the power to send Doom through a controlled rift and away from the island. Got it. Now, this has actually been done before, back in Chapter 2, Season 4, when they sent Galactus back to Earth-616 quite successfully. I feel like things never work well twice, which makes me think these Rift devices will go wrong, which, even in this dialogue, they do. It's time. Initiating Rift Recalibrators. What's happening? The Recalibrators are short-circuiting. But why? I've heard this island's cowards whimper your name in fear. Hope. You may be prophecy, but I am judgment. Doctor Doom spits in the hardest bar of 2024. And just talking about controlled rifts, the rift gate was one too, and that also went a bit wrong. And when our weapons do finally cross in combat, I expect to find you wanting. It's September. In a few months' time, we should be on the Chapter 2 map. And I'm always trying to work out how will we get to Chapter 2? How would this play out differently from Chapter 4 OG? That doesn't involve a time machine. And one way would be for these Rift devices to not send Doom back to 616, but to Chapter 2. Doctor Doom has been on Artemis and Apollo, the Chapter 2 and Chapter 3 maps, and he wants to perfect that perfect order. What better way to go back to when the imagined order was at their height and also their most secretive. I also want to comment how naive they're being that they think this will work and keep him away from here. He came back twice, not once, twice. Suey and Jones will make their way to Doomstad at some point and it doesn't feel right being there. This place feels off. If Doom cannot yet see his true perfection, he will create the illusion of perfection. Clarify that unsettling sensation you feel? It is Mysterio's illusory conjurings. Well then, I guess we have an illusion to unillusionify. That is not a word. I'll make it catch on. This is wrong. Who knows how long these innocent people had to live under Mysterio's thrall? Robbed of their feelings, their free will, their personhood. Mysterio will pay for this. Hey, there it is. There's that fire. You feel what you feel right now? That burning need to right an injustice? That's why we follow your lead. So during these quests, Hope will go through a lot of self-doubt, where she wrestles with herself. Is she the right person? Do I deserve to have this much responsibility? There has to be better people for the Let's job. Let's do this. You know, Shuri's a super genius in a super suit who traveled all the way across reality to fight Doom. And me? 
I didn't do any of that. Since the Oracle's prophecy, everyone's been looking to me as their leader. And on the outside, I try my best to play the part. But on the inside, I can't help but wonder if maybe the box picked the wrong girl. I have no powers. I'm no master tactician. I'm just a girl with some spray cans. The one thing I can do is try. As hard as I can. With everything I've got. I hope it's enough. So back to Hope and Jones at Doomstead. That's why we follow your lead. That's what's gonna take Doom down. I just know it. Anyone who saw what happened here would feel the same way. Nuh-uh, you're wrong. That fire inside you is special. You just have to believe that it is. It doesn't seem like much, Jones. Believe me. It's everything. Mysterio's down. Good riddance. Can I get a status report on the new Rift Recalibrators? Sure, he's made replacements. Once Emma Frost is neutralized, we will be ready to Rift Doom out of here whenever he reappears. You doing okay? I believe the Rift Calibrators will be more trouble than they're worth. I really do. I'm sure Shui has fixed the problem, but Doom can make problems. You seem better. Gloomy, scary prophecy aside, today I took a wrong and set it right. That felt good. <laughs> yeah, it did. Look at you. Accepting the hero's mantle. Okay, don't be weird. Perhaps now that the illusion has been shattered, you'll see the truth. Oh, is the truth that I have everything I need to defeat Doom? I sense that perhaps you see the words, but not the intention behind those words. You could just tell me the intention. In fact, I would love it if you just told me the intention. You've heard the saying. You can lead a clombo to clomberries, but you can't make it eat? You are the clombo. Prophetic enlightenment is the clomberries. And I'm the one holding the big spinning sign that says clomberries this way in conversational clombish. The clomberries are right in front of you. It is you who must take a bite. And where does the blowhole come into play? Ugh. A lot to unpack now. Hope believes it's her fault that the rift calibrators didn't work at first. Taking down Mysterio felt like she wrote a wrong, but she's on the fine line of being a bit too overconfident. And the back end of this dialogue mentions Columbo. They're meant to be returning back to Fortnite in Fortnite Lego at some point. And also they seem to have their own language, conversational Columbish. Of course, Jonesy knows about a hundred thousand languages, so I presume he knew what she was saying. Now it does ask another question, where have the Columbos been? Well, back in chapter three, Haven said this, for Columbos disappeared in the same strange flash of light that brought them here, leading many to presume they had the ability to rift. Well, it looks like that bit of lore seemed to be confirmed. New Lego Columbo teasers by Haven. I'm searching for a group of wandering creatures known as Columbo. Judging by their migratory patterns, they should be drawing near to this reality, somewhere with lost jungles and fragrant grottos. Suggesting they've just been rifting around this whole time. And also the fact that Lego is getting a jungle biome and lost grottos, I presume. A long time ago, I encountered a group of Columbo on a mysterious island. I don't remember much about that place, but it was wild and full of combat. So hopefully the reason she doesn't remember is because it happened millennia ago, not because she was in a loop, because this proves she wasn't inside the loop and she was outside the loop. She should remember this stuff. She clearly has the ability to talk. Well, that's how I believe the loop works. It has got a bit sketchy over the last couple of years. Oh no, in Story Quest dialogue, they do mention the word looper twice. I had some weird conversations with loopers around here. Be on a high alert, Hope. Why are these Doom bots behaving like loopers? And of course, this chapter we've had previous mentions of zero point, zero point energy, and as well as rifts have also been mentioned, I've said it in this video. I've always been on the understanding that the loop and the zero point are still here, but does it look like how it used to look like back in chapter two, chapter three? I believe what we saw at the end of Big Bang is kind of like a new loop, the new zero point, because the loop effect is in the other game modes. Lego, you respawn, you rift in. Same with Festival. I think it's just change. It's slightly different, but that could be thrown out the window next week. I don't know. Comment down below what you think about the loop and the zero point and that whole saga. Talking of quest lines, Dr. Doom has taken shots at the Fantastic Four and Tony Stark in Doom quests. To unlock the Doom bonus awards, Stark thinks himself a genius inventor. I beg to differ. Drop War Machines, Arsenal, Hover Jets and Auto Turret. 
I'm not overly fond of that number. Damage opponents from beyond 44 meters. Gwenpool's dual micro SMGs are now in game and you can buy them from her or take them from someone else. Gwenpool is a fourth wall breaking character and so too are her weapons. If you look at the elimination feed, it will be slightly different. Miss J.R. White raised Anominus from script with Gwenpool's jewelries. And there is a array of others. My favorite one has to be, is this thing on? Oh, I help player not enemy. I think that's my favorite. We also have Shuri's Black Panther Globs. And when pouncing, should eliminate fall damage. EMP grenades will now disable the turret, which makes no sense why they didn't make this a feature for the cars to disable the car and the turret at different times. Like five seconds of a car, 15 seconds for the turret. Anyway, guys, it's been Miss JLY here. I hope you did enjoy, and until next time, bye bye.